Hey fellow artists! Perfectionism and fear of failure can really hinder our creativity and growth. But we can fight back using creativity itself as the antidote. In this video, I'll share strategies to manage your inner critic, overcome perfectionism, and conquer the fear of failure. First, accept that imperfection is part of the creative process. See the beauty in mistakes and flaws as chances to learn. Break big projects into smaller, achievable goals. Focusing on progress beats perfection. Foster a non-judgmental creative space free of self-criticism. Experiment without fear here. Do the bad art challenge. Make something intentionally imperfect. It's liberating. Limit your options and materials. Restrictions encourage creative problem solving. Use time constraints. Tick tick tick. The clock pressure centers you in the process. Allow accidents and surprises to guide you. The unexpected births beauty. Share works in progress. Feedback provides perspective and encouragement. Journal your thoughts, feelings, and creative blocks. Explore and overcome fears. Use fear as inspiration. Transform anxieties into cathartic art. Celebrate all achievements, no matter how small. Each step defeats perfectionism. Replace self-criticism with positive self-talk. Be your own cheerleader. Practice mindfulness while creating. Quiet your inner critic through presence. Venture into unfamiliar mediums and techniques. Leap from your comfort zone. Seek support from mentors or therapists who assist artists. Get professional guidance. Join our Fearless Creators community to connect with kindred artistic souls. Perfectionism and fear are natural challenges. But by incorporating these strategies into your creative practice, you can turn them into growth and self-discovery. Use your art to conquer inner critics and fully embrace the joy of imagination. Let's defeat perfectionism and fear together. Art heals minds believe in you. Now believe in yourself. Happy creative journeying. Find more resources at arthealsminds.com. Please like and subscribe.